What's going on everybody? Um, for those of you listening along, this is really just a way to shout out to Luke. I know he watches my videos and he follows along with the content. Um, so here nor there, I don't give a fuck who else listens to this. And that's my approach going forward. Um, what I want to say to you though, Luke, is you have a lot of loyal followers. They listen to you every single week. They wait on every single video. And they don't necessarily comment on every single one of them. As they don't also subscribe to your content. But these people hang on your tooth and nail. To find out what your sentiment is. Who gives a shit about the comment section? And... Recently, I've noticed, man, and I'm not trying to knock it shit. You get a little upset about like what's written in the comments. For a long time, we've known that in those comments, there's nothing but bots that are meant to instigate people that are, you know, traders and investors. Because that's what we are, just like you had pointed out. But what's important for you to understand, and also us to understand as a community, that's what those comment boxes are filled with and eventually what ends up happening in sales is you have a client and you might piss them off they'll go on to Yelp and they'll go on to like Google reviews and they'll write a bad review about you and they'll say you suck this that like the good customer that had a happy experience that it was just perfectly normal and everything worked out well, they never rate anything. So for those of us who have been making money with you, Lou, I want to reach out and say to you, forget the bullshit that's written in those comments. People are going to stop writing the good shit in those comments eventually. They just get bored of it. You know, that that's my personal sentiment and that's what you've taught us to be, sentimental traders, right? So... Moving forward, I would love it if you keep kept up with the comments. No, I mean, come, kept up with the uh, content. That's a little bit of a Freudian slip, you know? Um, but with that being said, keep up with the videos. Don't read the comments. Post things on there. You don't have to be instigative. You don't have to have uh, an enemy that's out there. The little motherfuckers that write on these comments, they're all just people that are jealous but there are also people that follow you very closely and they're a majority of the ones that actually watch your videos. You see, the people that comment on your videos, they read the title and then they write in the comment section whatever the fuck they want to write to try to beat up and bash on you, all right? And that tells you right then and there that that was premeditated. That's a hedge fund. That's somebody that's hired to go out there and fucking write shit. So moving forward, Lou, stop being so sensitive with these pieces of shit. Like, they don't mean anything. The good people aren't going to comment like they used to. They're just bored with that kind of thing. When we fucking hit, trust me, everybody will. And I'm in this play with you, buddy. I have every last token of mine in it. So, moving forward, buddy, please make the videos. We miss you, man. I know it's stressful, but it's more stressful if you read those comments. Who gives a fuck about that shit? Don't even set your alerts. Who gives a shit? Use your other account to watch the shit you want to watch. And then when that little red blurb fills the fuck up, it has nothing to do with, like, you communicating with them. All right, like, so when you get that alert saying that you have all those notifications of people that have commented on your shit, that shouldn't make no difference to you. Uh, you. You shouldn't even bother reading it. You're not developing content off of what those people are saying, so fuck it. Bro, move on from those assholes. Please keep giving us content. We appreciate everything that you do. And, yo, I'm putting it out there. And, like, I hope I don't sound like that much of, like, an, an ass kiss or a dick suck or any of that shit. I'm here trying to fucking get you over that hump dog because we're about to do big things with Cosm and with you at the helm man we can do a lot of big things moving forward with a smaller community and we'll know who each other are moving forward because we'll see each other at Vegas 
we don't have to announce it. We can then keep that small. And we'll know the people that aren't us. They won't have money. So, I'll catch you later, fam. C-O-S-M until the end, bro.